since uh, probably last summer. Since probably last summer, I've been really wanted. I've been really wanting to get rid of the evil part, even though it's for everywhere. Though I really just I've wanted to get rid of it because I've always felt that it kind of hampers the growth of the community and what i mean by that is ever since i started my channel and i go to other people's shows or i you know people i meet new people and they're always like why do you why are you called the evil cj you're not evil and so it's one of those things that has always stuck with me you know even though it's the word play. It's not spelled the same way E V I L is. It has an L and an E. You know, not everybody understands the word play. Since last summer, I, I've always felt like it always hampered the community in a small way because people that don't know the community or people that don't know the channel. Or people that don't even know what we talk about because they just automatically assume maybe I'm a hate channel. Maybe I'm a channel that isn't about positivity and progress and peace. You know, when I started out the Evil CJ show, the podcast, you know, it, was, it wasn't even really going to be about true crime. It was going to be about current events. Things that went around, you know, that were going on in the world, whether it was economics, politics, uh, sports, uh, crime, uh, you know, achievements in, you know, in human evolution, you know, just all sorts of different things. And that's why it was just called the show. But. You know, as we started this show, within a month, it had already quickly turned into a true crime channel. Because of where my soul led me, it was like, I can't, I can't in good energy talk about sports when there's so many victims out there that need a voice to speak up, you know? And so, that's why it became, even though it was different intentions from the beginning, the main thing was community, regardless of whatever we talked about. It was about community. And so, it, it, it has grown to what it has grown today. And so, I think with the new year... And in all fairness to maybe the people that don't know about our community, I think it's only fair to get rid of the evil part. So that way, people that don't know anything about us don't assume that it's not peace, positivity, and progress, which you walk up to a door to a house and you see evil on it, even though it might have beautiful pieces of art inside and it's all a, a a positive experience they don't even open the door because of what's on the door you know there's a lot of content creators out there that i was uh collabing with you know or anybody that comes to the show or that i run run into you know on another panel or something you know i always hear the same thing I always hear, why is your name evil? Because you're not evil. And it's something that's always been in the back of my head. The name, even though it's spelled E-V-I-L-L-E. -L -L -E, what if the name... What if the name already turns somebody around when they don't even know? You know, I compared it earlier to... You know, somebody would see the word evil on a door. And even though inside that door, 
there's positivity, there's peace, there's progress. Because the door says evil. Even though it's not spelled that way. They might just turn right back around. And so I started to think about it and I'm like, you know, I hear these things when I run into other people. Why is your name evil? You're not evil. There's automatically this, you know, and in, in no fault of anyone's, there's automatically this assumption. And I, the last thing that I want anybody to think of the community or anybody to think of even what we talk about is anything negative or evil or any of those things. And so I thought, you know, now's the time. The last thing that I want to do is have some stranger that doesn't even know any of us come across the channel and just because of the name automatically think evil. The new name, why the new name, where we're coming from, the purpose of it and what we're trying to maintain and achieve. And so I think as we transition from a show that started off being about moon landings and ghost hauntings and, um, you know, just whatever that we never even really talked about. We're transitioning into that crime because that's all we have talked about, really, for a year. And so I think it's important. I think it's important not only for future community. Because the last thing that I would want anybody to do is come up to our door for our community house. See the word evil on that door. And then turn around thinking that any of us in this community are about that. And so I think it starts with the name on the door. It starts with the name on the channel. And so therefore, uh, the evil will not be a part of the show anymore. Uh, this is what the channel will be called uh, from now on. It will be called CJ's Crime Concepts Podcast. And my handle will be CJ's Crime Concepts. So anybody that sees me from this point on, this is what my handle will be. This is what the name of the channel will be. And this is what we will be moving forward. CCC with the PPP 100. I think it's I think it's just time to to get rid of the evil part because I think uh, even though it's spelled differently, the last thing that I want to do is have one you know amazing soul just turn around just because. They didn't even open the door because of what name was on the door. So I think it's going to be very important. Uh, and it'll represent the community a lot better uh, when it comes to the community. Even though everybody knows how we are out there when we go to other shows, I think for the people that don't know, it's going to represent the community a lot better.